my friends welcome back to my cooking channel Ellen's homemade delights and today in my southern kitchen I'm gonna share with all of y'all another great cobbler recipe is one of my favorites that would satisfy your Memorial Day barbecue or anytime in the summer fresh strawberry cobbler and my friends it is so simple and easy to make and it's full of fresh strawberry flavor and as always it is the bomb.com delicious Everybody's going to fall in love with this and it will be a hit. And I'll post a complete recipe along with the instructions down below in the description box. And for more cobbler recipes, check out my cobbler recipes playlist. So grab your flour, your butter, and your fresh strawberries, sugar, because we're about to bake some strawberry cobbler magic in my southern kitchen. Here we go. All right, my friends, over here, I have my 9 by 13 inch baking dish with a half a cup, which is one stick of unsalted butter. Going to place it in the oven at 350 degrees, and we're going to let that melt all the way. And while that's melting, let's go ahead and prep our strawberries. Over here, I have my beautiful fresh strawberries, and I rinse them. I'm going to remove the tops and chop them up. We need three cups. All righty. I got all my sliced strawberries together in my large bowl. So now we're going to add in a half a cup of white sugar and two teaspoons of freshly squeezed lemon juice. Give it a quick stir until it's well blended. It will create a glaze. Alrighty, my friends, I'm through stirring up my strawberries and they turn into a nice glaze and they're juicy. So now we're going to set them aside while we work on the best part, the crust. We need one and a half cups of stuffed rice and flour. So I'm going to use my one cup measurement. I'm going to fluff it up. I'm going to level it off. Get an even scoop. Voila, perfect cup. Gonna place it into my bowl with a sifter. You can also whisk your dry ingredients. And also, if you don't have stuffed rice and flour, you can use all purpose flour. Just add two teaspoons of baking powder and a half a teaspoon of salt. Now we need a half a cup. Again, fluff it up. And level it off. And a perfect half a cup. And the two hour flour, we're going to add in one teaspoon of ground cinnamon. And one cup of white sugar. And sift these together. Alrighty. Next, we're going to add in one teaspoon of pure vanilla extract, one teaspoon of pure strawberry extract, and one and a half cups of my favorite milk, evaporated milk. Going to add in half and whisk. And whisk them all together until they're well combined. And that's it, my friends. Our crust is complete. How simple and easy was that? And our butter is nice and melted. We're ready to build our strawberry cobbler. So we're going to pour the batter on top of the butter. Alrighty, now we're going to add on the strawberries right on top like so, along with the juice. And make sure you don't stir it. Otherwise, the strawberries and the butter will be laying in there. We want this cobbler to come out and the crust rise up like magic. Now 
Mmm, love the smell of fresh strawberries. Smells good. Alrighty, my friends. Now we're ready to put this cobbler in the oven. We're gonna put it in the same temperature we melt the butter on, 350 degrees, and we're gonna let it bake for about 45 minutes until the crust is golden brown. And I'll bring you back. All right, my friends, there you have it. Fresh strawberry cobbler. Don't that look good? And look at the strawberries just oozing out. Mmm, and it smells heavenly. And I'm gonna let it cool for a few minutes and then I'll fix me up a plate and I'll give the taste. All right, my friends, I fixed me up a plate and I'm serving it with a strawberry and a scoop of my homemade strawberry ice cream that I made on my last video. I'll post a link to that down below in the description box. Isn't that pretty? Now it's time for the best part, the tasting. Here we go. Grab a little crust. Some strawberries. Mm-mm. Look at that. Have a bite. Strawberries is tender and flavorful, and the crust is buttery. Nothing like strawberry. This is fantastic, my friends. Please give this recipe a try. This is Herb Nilla Biden. I'm going to grab me a little ice cream. Mm-mm. Yum-o. Strawberry cobbler delicious. My friends, I want to thank all y'all for watching and joining me in my southern kitchen today. If you enjoyed this recipe, please give it a thumbs up. I really do appreciate it. Don't forget to share this with your family and friends. Like, comment, subscribe to my channel, and click on the bell so that way you'll be notified when my new videos come out. Also, follow me on social media. Facebook, Ellen's Homemade Delights, and Instagram at Ellen Delights. And don't forget to hashtag Ellen's Homemade Delights and the purchase a cookbook along with your picture. Please send me an email, Ellen's Homemade Delights at gmail.com. I would love to see your beautiful creations with my recipes. And I'll see you next time. Let's eat. Much love and happy Memorial Day.